all right welcome back to the blog channel y'all uh, this is a kind of video that would be on half points tv but i don't have up half points tv up and going yet so so i'm gonna do it on here we are at a old graveyard the name of this place is called uh long dying baptist church which as you see i don't even see a church anymore i guess it used to be right there as you can tell it's old i think there used to be a church right there i think these things used to be pillars or something but uh my mom's gonna gum out and She's going to make her version of this video in a minute. I think she's smoking a cigarette. But yeah, you got a lot of walkway. A little patio thing. There's some steps here. Yeah, I know. That's what I was saying. Like, it must have been about 100 years ago. Where the church used to be is a little small fortress. I wonder what this is. I guess this is what used to be a well. I wonder how the hell you get into it. I guess remove the roof. Yeah. The church was kind of a small church, I'm guessing, because that's not a big area. And the graveyard, it's not really that big neither, because it's just on the side of the church. But we're going to see how old these graves is. I don't know if there's any graves, like, right here or not. But you can see another piece of the church right here. Hold up. I'm going in here. If I can get out the spider webs. Ah, 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 this is a savage moment because I don't know if there's any fucking snakes in here or not. You hear me scream like a bitch, you'll find out. Just being real with you. I don't know. Now, I found something over here. Hold on. Let me get back out of this. Ah. Let's see what we got over here. Most definitely probably a part of the church. Oh, look at this, y'all. Wiring. Little pieces of, like, things to go in graves. Um, looks like a piece of metal. Another thing to go in a grave. Buckets. Dude, that is weird. I want to go up in there, but that looks like a snaky territory. And I am scared shit with some snakes. But yeah, uh, like, look at this grave over here. This is crazy. This is in loving memory. And I don't have a name. But you can definitely tell somebody's been buried there. At least two people. Maybe three. But look at this one. <sighs> Yeah, this dude was in the U.S. Army. PFC, U.S. Army, Vietnam. And he died in 1998. But this grave ain't as old as I thought it was. He was a little filler. About my height. And that one... That person passed away the year I was born. Let me take some shit. 1994. Well, that one's a military. Um, wonder how many other militaries is out here. Uh, let's see here. Look at that. 
You can tell nobody took care of, of these graves. 2008. That's a fairly new one. Um, 2014. It's probably about the newest so far. 1989. 2007. Uh, 2004, 2016, this is the newest one right here, you can tell that's brand new, and then that piece over there looks about brand new, but it's not, and I like how they have the little fence in back there, it's not really a big graveyard, and there's not really much here to show, but maybe I can, maybe I can get in. Maybe I can get in right here. Uh -huh. Yeah, it did burn. Yeah, it definitely burnt. Yeah, look at that. There's a military personnel that's buried over there that was in the Vietnam War. A new Lone Pine Church right up the road. And it also has a graveyard. But as I said, I don't know what happened. What made the church burn? Somebody burned it down and then all the list was hidden. I don't know, Mama, but. Hold on, y'all. You need to show them this. It's like a building with a building around it. Look. Right there. Do you, do you see it? Hey, right here goes a better entryway. I'm gonna see what's all up in there. Probably nothing but weeds. Ah. That's crazy. My mama just told me that these Benches back here supposedly has ashes in the legs of them. Oh man, I'm definitely gonna be bleeding after this. Um, there's nothing left here, dude. Nothing. Look, all it is is grown up trees and a few bricks and a few cinder blocks. Well, there's a bunch of cinder blocks and a bunch of bricks, but there ain't much nothing left here. But I would love to find a beautiful piece to take home. That way if one day I meet one of my fans that watch these videos, I could take a piece of this place and give it to a fan. And I'm going to take this gnarly looking brick right here because it's cool. And now I'm going to take this brand new brick. That way I can have one to collect myself. I'll give a brand new brick away. And I will keep the old gnarly looking one because it's just badass. I will definitely try to sign the brick that I'm going to do a giveaway with. And I'm just going to use the other one to uh, do something with my house, my camper. And that way, those that watch Half Point TV, y'all see a part of every video that I do. Um, she said that inside them two legs right there, there's supposed to be ashes. I don't know how true that is. Then I'm gonna come over here and walk over here and look at this. My daddy, John R. Vinson, 2006 is when he passed away. Dude, man, he was two years younger than my papa. And dang, she was born in 1927 too. August and September. Edna L. Henson. But yeah, she said that their ashes are in the legs. And I'm definitely gonna, like I said, I'm gonna take these bricks home and 
I'm gonna do something special with them. I'm gonna keep the gnarly one, unless a real good fan that watches this video and like meets me and says, dude, I like the little gnarly brick that you got there. I I I'll do a giveaway. But uh, it's just something this small that I don't think nobody would ever care about. I got one for myself and one for a subscriber. And as y'all see, this is it. There ain't too much more to show. So I guess I'm going to be ending it off on that one. I was going to walk all the way through that, but... Did you see the one that's a military? Look, I'm going to take this. Okay, I know it was a short video, but it is what it is. Yeah. Same with my mom said. It's a video. It's a short one, but it's a video. Spirit box. But yeah. And eventually we can make something out of that here, like a campsite. But uh, yeah, I'm gonna try to find like little small things at certain areas that I go to that are like haunted. Kind of like most RG did, a haunted doll. If I can find a haunted doll at a place, yeah, I'm gonna probably try to take that because that would be cool. And mama would want it, wouldn't your mama? But yeah, she said she's gonna take me to another, is it a graveyard or a church? Both. Another graveyard and church, so wait for a new one. <laughs>